Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Pokemon Sleep. Let's head into last night's sleep research and see how things went. Ooh, I have a small amount of data to download. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Full night's rest, 100 sleep score, 32 minutes more than yesterday. Ooh, and some big chunks of snoozing sleep and big chunks of slumbering. But slumbering wins out with 7% more than my historical average. Alright, 39 million drowsy power, nearly 40 million. We've got a full house with a good mix of 1, 2, and a 4 star. Let's see who showed up. Alrighty, we got Cubone atop belly. We got Sfeel, Dote Duo, Cubone, um, Magnazone. Wow, that's a nice big, uh, big third evolution there. We got Squirtle, Cubone, and Sfeel. Pseudo Wudo and Magnemite. No Lapis spawns again. Kind of interesting. Was hoping to see a little bit more of them as the week winds down. No, nope, still have tomorrow. And technically Monday morning. Alright, but down to eight more sleep styles until Lapis Lakeside unlocks. We've got Swinging Sleep from Magnazone. This one only has three sleep styles. <coughs> its screws and magnets spin even while it sleeps. It said that sleeping Magnazone emits signals of unknown purpose and receives signals of unknown origin, but researchers are divided on this point. So it's doing some fun radio wave uh, transmission. All right, who's hungry? Just Do Duo. All right. Yeah, Magnazone is not happening unless it's hungry, because that is a just big boatload of pips to fill. I'm good on pretty much everything else. Like, I got two really good spiel. I've got... I'm going to get the do this do duo because it's hungry. I don't really need more than that. Uh... And I mean, I mean, there is a Squirtle, so I do feel compelled to recruit that. So, I'm going to give my boy Squirtle the premium biscuit. Just because I'm a sucker for that. And we'll give Dojuo the regular biscuit. We gotta also see what the uh, Daily Lottery's got for us today. Let's take a look. Oh, we got 10 Pokemon befriended, so that takes care of another mission this week. 20 Diamonds! Alright. Let's wrap that up and move on. Okay. I'm gonna leave Magazone. It's a, uh, it's a fun spawn to see show up. A nice big chunk of research XP because it's a not very oftenly seen Pokemon. And let's check some stats. We got a gentle natural Squirtle ingredient collector. This one's got milk, cocoa, milk. 
Helping bonus, skill trigger, helping speed, ingredient finder, inventory up with main skill chance up. Not bad. We'll see how that stacks. Report back. <laughs> Even if it's not great, like, I'll still hold on to it. We a lonely nature doe duo, which is strange because it's always got a friend. Doe duo's a berry collector. This one's got uh, soybeans and cocoa. We got skill triggers, <laughs> inventory up, dream shard bonus, and helping speed. With speed of help up. So, it probably won't rate well as far as its uh, overall IVs, but the fact that it's got skill triggers back to back, meaning that that charge energy to recover itself is going to be up, this could actually also be a really good uh, berry collector. Just from because of the fact that it's if it remains topped up at its peak efficiencies, uh, that could be real good. So I'm definitely curious to see how that uh, works out. Okay, some sneaky snacking from the night before. Some apples today, which is good because I need apples and cocoa if I want to make <laughs> our wonderful Valentine's Day dessert dish. And we got diamonds and dream shards for that. So between today and tomorrow, just making sure I get my cooks in, that's fine. And we've already completed all of the Lapis Lakeside stuff for the event. So all of that's good, too. We got 200 sleep points. Got another thousand to go before we're <laughs> good to keep collecting for March. No additional news. And... <clears throat> Green Metals. Uh, Ice-type Pokemon. Thank you, Sveal. Ground-type Pokemon. I guess that's Cubone. And Steel-type Pokemon. That's technically Magnezone. All diamonds. Great. Basically now completely paid back for the Dratini incense that I picked up. Uh, you'll notice notes got new. I was able to cook the new dessert dish yesterday, so we're going to see if we can try to do that again today. 39 reports coming in. Fun fact on that, I actually did see someone on Reddit yesterday that actually got all 50 of their friends in a single report. So it is technically possible. It's just, I'm guessing, very, very difficult. So we'll keep playing the lottery until uh, until that happens. <laughs> That'll be a fun little addition. Alright. Pick up some more apples. I don't think that's enough for me to make the dessert again. But maybe Blastoise will trigger. No, why would that happen? <laughs> Not making it easy for me. Alright, let's choose a recipe. Yeah, so we can see there, based on strength, there it is, the Petal Dance Chocolate Tart. and was able to make that and got to level 6. It's just about to level 7, um, but I am short. Probably two apples. Yeah. Pikachu is really the only main source of apples aside from the rewards tickets. So um, it just doesn't happen as much as I would like it to. And I don't think I have any additional ingredients tickets that I can kind of gamble with today. Let's take a look. I can't check from the cooking menu, so... Devs, if you're listening, that would be great. Yeah. Just my emergency tickets. I'm not going to worry about that. It's nice that it's unlocked now, so that's really the hard part of it. Alright. We'll throw 66 ingredients in the pot and just clear out my inventory. Alright. 
All right, 13,000, not bad. Not enough to rank up, but uh, at least the milk is nice and strong, so it is always consistently pulling in some good numbers. Realistically today, um, I'm just gonna keep... We'll see where things go ingredient-wise. It's obviously not going to be quite where we were for this time last week. Um, just because of the swap out in uh, Eevee with Stuffle. But uh, still, Master 8. That's still good. Um, I still like it still feels good with where things are. I'm I'm happier to get some more leveling going on for some of the Pokemon that I need on other teams. Uh, and uh, we're we're at a point where all the spawns really that I would want to show up are there. I'm not trying to kind of min max on green grass just yet. Ugh, but that's gonna take care of things for today. Nice short sweet to the point. Let me know how your week's going down in the comments below. And I'll see you back tomorrow for some more sleep research. But until then, sleep well.